transgressions. All of us have them and all of us want to limit them. And all of us need to learn how to return to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala once committing them. It's only the mercy of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala that can remove it permanently from our records. It's an incredible journey that I seek to set upon with you in understanding what are the common transgressions, sometimes ones that we are not as attentive to as we should be, and some of the things that can add as small minor errors to become the size of mountains of sins in our scale on the Day of Judgment. I hope insha'Allah through this journey that we can learn the important lesson that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala sent our Nabi sallallahu alayhi wa sallam with to teach us how to pick ourselves up once we've stumbled and how to return to Allah even if it is one step at a time. I hope insha'Allah that you will share with me in this journey as we discuss transgressions, how to avoid them, and how to return back to Allah from them so that we can be from those who rejoice and be called by Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala as those who He loves. Inna Allah yuhibbu tawwabin wa yuhibbu mutatahirin. Surely Allah loves those who return back repentant to Him. He loves those who return to Him in purity.